All right, just in time for the weekend, Cheetah. Thank you. Uh, well, as businesses begin to reopen, we know a lot of you guys are just, you're relieved to get back to work. But some people, they're concerned about their safety. So question is, what do you do if you're afraid to go back to work? Here's Consumer Reporter John Matarese with those answers. Stores, office buildings, and some restaurants are now starting to reopen around Texas. But some employees are nervous about going back to work so soon and are wondering if they can still collect unemployment benefits if they decide to stay home. Hair salons are starting to reopen in some states and calling stylists back to work. But Chrissy Yelton isn't sure she feels comfortable. We cut hair. We're inches from people's faces. Multiple clients a day. Her franchise just sent this letter stating, we'd like you to resume work. We will formally notify the state unemployment office. That means no more unemployment benefits. It's the same at other businesses like Starbucks, where workers are now being recalled. But some are nervous, saying they're reluctant to deal with customers all day. But from the doesn't that stink file, what happens if you don't go in? Business Insider says fearful Starbucks employees say they'd rather collect unemployment than risk their health returning to work, except they can't. That's right. If your business recalls you, it's go back or go unpaid, no matter how worried you are about catching COVID like Chrissy. So that's 20 to 30 times a day that I could potentially be exposed to a virus. But the U.S. Department of Labor says unemployment ends when you are recalled unless you have COVID-19 or are caring for someone who has it. If you have serious health concerns, speak with your employer. Otherwise, staying home could soon become very costly. As always, don't waste your money. I'm John Matteries for H-Town Rush.